popping y'all it's your boy Kaden the rake man and today's topic is going to be at some point she is going to wonder bro if you've gone absent if you started to work on yourself if you start to become a man of priority she is going to wonder but it go deeper than that bro it go way deeper than that this for the guys who worried about a girl this for the guys who worried about women in general I'm finna let y'all know something, bro. First, hit that like button, comment, subscribe, but more importantly than anything, bro, share the video, bro. Share it. Go ahead. Share it to anybody who would listen, bro, because they need the message. Anyway, if you a dude who wondering about a girl, you already starting off on a bad foot. If you a guy who wor worried about your ex, worried about no contact, and you over here like, man, when is she gonna hit me up? What day is she gonna hit me up? I went into no contact a week ago. I'm timing this. I'm going every step of the way, bro. You're already in the wrong position. You're already not in a position to receive her when she comes back. You are not in a position to get a woman back who rejected you. You are not even in a position to be with a new woman. Because this tells me that women take up too much of your life, bro. You are too into what they are doing and not into what you are doing bro here's the reality men of priority rarely worry about what women got going on i'm gonna tell you some truth bro some real truth two-thirds of the women that i meet nowadays two-thirds of the women who come to me who i spend my time with they hit me up they ask me for my time they beg me for my time so think about it like that you got an ex and you in no contact and you want this woman back and she ain't hit you up she ain't said nothing to you she ain't so much as liked a picture of yours bro since she left and you over here obsessing about her you over here worried about her you worried about the wrong things bro <clears throat> for real for real you worried about the wrong stuff because at the end of the day guess what she not worried about you so what does that tell you that tells you her attraction is not high enough but more importantly, that tells you she is not valuing you to the level that you should because truth. We know three truths, right? Here's one. One, we know priority men. Women seek their time. Women beg for their time and attention. Women want to be around them. Number two, we know that women are always going to make it easy for the guy that they actually like. They're always going to make it easy for the dude that they want. By her not hitting you up, do you think that's her making it easy for you, bro? It don't seem like it to me. Unless it's backwards day or something. You remember that shit when you was a kid? Backwards day? Remember we used to play? Oh, maybe that was just us. You know what I mean? In Chicago, maybe that's just a Chicago thing. But maybe it's backwards day. Because guess what? At the end of the day, a woman who like you, who wants you, the doors open, bro. They open easily. You ain't even got to push them. It's like a ghost in the room. They just open. Easy. So if she not hitting you up, she's not making it easy for you, bro. She's not. Number three, the most important thing that we know about all of this, right? The most important, and take this one to heart, bro. If she is not hitting you up, if she is not prioritizing you, if she is not contacting you, if she is not telling you that she wants you in some type of capacity, if she is not asking for your time, attention, affection, bro, if she does not want your currency, bro, then you should not be offering it at a discount. See, that's the problem with too many guys, bro. You so focused on this woman who eventually gonna wonder about you if you just do the right things. But you so focused on this woman that you giving everything that you got to the wrong thing. The truth is you got the grind in you, bro. The truth is you can become a man of priority, bro. The truth is you got what it takes. You are him, bro. You got it. It's in you. But you pointed in the wrong direction. You worried about the wrong things. And all of the time you spending worrying about her. What she doing? Who she with? Where she at? On social media. Is that towards me? Is that post about me? Is she wondering about me right now? All of that time you spending worried about a woman who is going to worry about you. If you worry about the right things, bro. But you ain't doing that. And see, for every minute you waste, bro, for every second you waste, it's slipping away. The counterintuitive thing is happening. The opposite of what you want is occurring, bro. When you obsess over this woman, when you worry about this woman, when you don't relax, get your life together, focus on yourself as a man, become the best version of you, bro. Bug up. Get that passion, bro. 
Go get that car you want. Go grind out and get that crib you want, bro. Get that new wardrobe change. Get that white gold chain. Get whatever you want, bro. Go get it. When you do that, when you get a new focus, when you get a new lease on life, when you decide to value yourself above everything, funny things start to happen, bro. Funny things start to occur. You start to see more women start marching into your life. They like ants. Like that ant movie, do, do, do. They just march into your life, bro. They just make it easy for you. And then you start realizing girls offering you. Like I can show you on my phone right now, bro. Women, can I come over and give you a massage? Oh, well, can we spend Saturday night together? Can we? They start giving you all of that energy. Then you get all that energy from these women over here. Sevens, eights, nines. You might not be getting the tens just yet because you ain't got all the way there just yet. But you're getting energy from women, bro. Then you realize that funny things start to happen, bro. Then she start dropping subliminals on her social media. The girl you was worried about. But you ain't really paying attention to it. You want to know why you ain't paying attention to it? You don't even know this, bro. When you ready for her to come back into your life. When you ready to be over a woman. When you ready to move on to that next step. You don't even know this. You don't notice her social media. And the crazy thing about it is. She realized you don't notice her social media. Because you're not popping up in the people who looking at her stories. You ain't hearting her messages. You ain't hearting her pictures. You ain't talking about her to your friends who talking about you to her friends because they trying to get in their drawers. None of that happening. Nothing occurring. She hears nothing, bro. It's radio silence. Then what happens? Then she want to reach out because now you in abundance because now you got options because now you working on yourself because now you got money in your pocket because now you ascending to that new level, bro. You going super saiyan, bro. And she ain't never quite seen a warrior fighting like you. Now you at that point. And guess what? Everything about you is going to scream, I am him. So, bitch, come over here and treat me like I'm him. Otherwise, you can get to stepping. What they say on Martin? You can get to stepping. And when you got that energy, she the one begging you to be back in a relationship. She the one asking you to come over late at night to them things right there. She the one asking you. Because you don't need a technique, bro. You don't need some special thing to say. Your abundance mindset. Mixed with your newfound game. Mixed with your newfound confidence in a man who you're becoming. Mixed with the fact that you don't quite need her. Because you got three women begging you to come over. So if you're going to spend your time with her, she better be acting right. If you're still in a relationship with her, your newfound love for the gym, your newfound love for your hobbies, you spending your time working on your business so you ain't got time to entertain every little thing that go on with her or every little emotional change that happened. So you naturally in your masculine place. You naturally the rock. So when you spend time with her, you want to make it a good time. Because you know it ain't a long time. Guess what? She going to value that. Guess what? She going to treat you like him. And that is what makes me guarantee to you that if you do the right thing, she will wonder about you at some point, bro. Hit that like button, man. Comment, subscribe, share this video, bro. Your boy dropping dimes, man. We bugging over here. Let's get it.